Decks from Galliana Chrysler Jeep again. I wanted to show you real quick how to take the doors off of a Wrangler. So Jeep will supply you with this little toolkit. Whenever you open it up, you're going to notice a few things in here. First off is your instructions on how to remove the different types of tops. See listed here is the soft top. It'll also show you how to take apart everything else on, the, on a Wrangler. You've got a few different size bits here along with the uh, wrench. First thing we're going to do is take out our wrench. Set aside the two bits that we'll need. So this is the T30 Torx bit and the T50 Torx bit. You need both of these. I'll show you show you for what in just a moment. First thing, you go to this panel right here. Just some tabs to take this off. You see, it's connected with the cord here too, so you don't have to worry about losing it. The first thing I do before I start taking all this apart, if you turn on the ignition and roll down a window. It's gonna give you something to grab onto later. That we don't have to fuss with it quite as much. Moving back down here, I'm gonna pull the door in just a little bit and take this strap off of the hook here. Then you'll notice up here there's a red tab. Pull that up. And then there's a black button under this arm that's kind of hard to see. Push down on that, it releases the arm and swings the connection out of the way. Yeah, all free. I usually take this and put it in the bag right here. Turn the net, excuse me. And then moving to the outside. Moving to the outside, I take my T50 Torx bit. That's a short one. Right here are a couple of sleeves, and it shows you on the hinge itself. It's a T50 bit. Get your supply wrench. Turn it the right way. that comes out, a threaded sleeve. Very fine thread, as you can tell. important you want to make sure this is the last one you take off and the first one you put back on it's a t30 bit and that's why they give you the extension line it up it's going to take a little more torque because they make sure that it's in there because this is what's keeping the mirror from hitting the fender it's limiting the travel of the door This is the only one that comes with a washer, so keep your eye on that washer, too. Alright, once you do that, because you've already taken the door, or rolled the window down, I mean. If you notice right here at the hinges, Right off. That's it. So 
but you can even give you a place to put the bolts whenever you're done. In this compartment, you'll see they even have it uh, marked door hinges. And I usually put the limiter strap bolts where the windshield goes. So remove the back quarter window, the mailbox, the one-touch slider option, right where it's really simple. This whole piece right here removes. If you check out on the inside, a lot like the uh, three-piece Freedom Top, you've got some clips right here. Pull that one down. clear the pins on the bottom here that way you don't damage it that's all for that piece so in the rear of the jeep you're going to find the bag to, to place these tops so you take the driver's side first put it face up so the glass is inboard there is a uh, styrofoam bottom to this it's going to hold it in place and some instructions to tell you how to do this just to show you this is the passenger side, so I'm going to face the same thing. The uh, glass is going to be inboard to protect that. Slides in. You see it's got some reliefs here cut for the, uh, the, hitch or the straps. Make sure it lines up nice and snug. This piece is used to separate the two of them, so you want to tuck that in there. That way the, the paint isn't rubbing on each other. Over like this. One zipper. Secure everything. Then you're going to take this strap. Unhook it. Hold the whole thing up here. You can take this and cross it around either side. There you go, Dex, I got you. Good. Slide it up under the headrest. Secure it in place. with the one touch top on your highway to open air freedom is you hit the button right here all the power slides all the way to the rear so you don't have to take off any soft top or take apart any freaking soft top and this will come back at up to 50 miles an hour going down the road